depressing. I can't even see the cliffs. I mean, I can kind of make out that it's there. I've never experienced mist like this in my whole life. I literally could not see out of the front of my helmet. I think I'm gonna wait here for a little bit, see if it clears up. that it's clearing up on that side. Like you can kind of make it out now. Can you believe that I'm at the White Cliffs of Dover? So many seagulls. This is pretty flipping scary. It keeps on disconnecting, so I literally can't see anything. Ah, you can see it, it's in the distance. Hallelujah, it's appearing from the mist. Three compass errors, three blackouts. This is the footage that I got. Big bowl of tomato soup with a gluten-free roll and a cappuccino. Day one of trying to avoid sugar. Let's see how long this lasts. Does anyone else do this where you break up your roll and you put the whole thing into your soup? It's so good. Dover Castle is a medieval castle that was founded in the 11th century. It is the biggest castle in England. During the outbreak of the Second World War in 1939, the tunnels were first converted into an air raid shelter, an underground military command center, as well as an underground hospital. I just came out of the tunnels, but I couldn't film anything because you're not allowed to take any photos. But I'm telling you, if you're into castles and you like history, this is definitely a place that you have to visit. There are two tunnels that you can do guided tours at and unfortunately the queues are very long and so I could only do one of the tunnel tours. I decided to do the hospital tour which is in the upper layer of the tunnels. It's about nine meters below the ground but there are another two layers of tunnels underneath the tunnels that I was in. At least the mist has cleared up so I can actually see the castle. Okay let's keep on exploring. Roman coin necklace. I think it's pretty cool. You gotta buy stuff that you're going to use to help you remember. Let me know what you think. Dover Castle, thank you for having me, but it is now time for me to hit the road. Bye. Bye. This is my first time in Tesco and I cannot believe how big it is. There is so much stuff. Plus I'm buying myself a cliff bar because I've never tried them before. I'm so excited. It is white chocolate macadamia nut flavor. This is all in the name of trying to avoid eating sugar. Also what I find interesting is how all of the unhealthy things are on sale. I mean, yes, pro for me, but con for health of thousands of people. Okay, no, but for reals, what I bought is some mango chunks, because I need some fruit, some medjidol dates, some medjidol dates, 
I already ate one in the shop. Some glue. I'm busy working on something. A cliff bar. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. This is my drone. <laughs> I've already eaten this entire tub of mango and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven medjool dates. They're so good. But now it's time for the real deal. White chocolate macadamia nut cliff bar. Ooh. Looks delicious. Smells delicious. Tastes delicious. Anyway, today was epic. I mean, I got to see the white cliffs of Dover. I went to the Dover Castle. I went to Tesco. Freaking Tesco. I just realized I didn't show you guys the room that I'm staying in. There, I've shown you now. There's my closet. I'm thinking of doing a video all about what I travel with on my bike. So let me know if you'd be keen on that. Anyway, guys, tomorrow I am off to London. The big eye. I'm super excited. It's gonna be my first time back there in something like 16 years, which is crazy. My dad was born in London, for those of you who don't know, so I'm like 50% British, which is hilarious. <laughs> Not really. Actually, I don't know. Actually, yes, I think. I'm just gonna stop talking. I will see you all tomorrow. Bye.